The system requirements to complete this workshop successfully are as follows. Uh, you would need a desktop or a laptop with at least 4 GB of RAM. Uh, this is the recommended setting. Even if you have, let's say, 2 GB or 3 GB of RAM, uh, you might be able to finish this workshop successfully, but it might take you a little longer than everybody else. And we suggest you have a hard disk space of at least 1 GB. Uh, which is free so this it is 1 gb free on your hard disk so that you can download some data sets and some um, and some pickle files and um, and code right so any processor is okay whether you have an amd processor or an intel processor it doesn't really matter uh, the code that we have should work fairly easily on any processor as far as operating systems are concerned whether you have windows mac or linux it's, it's, it, it, it really doesn't matter because uh, we write most of our code in Python and it's very, very easy to execute Python code in any of these operating systems if you set up your system uh, properly. And in the next video, we'll explain you how to set up Python and all the necessary packages that come, uh, that come along with it, which are extremely important for successfully completing this workshop. Uh, we take a couple of shortcuts, if I have to say that, uh, to complete, uh, to ensure that we accommodate everyone. We want every student who is interested to complete this workshop to be able to do it. So to accommodate every student and every working professional who is interested to do this workshop, what we've done is instead of working on the full data that we have of, of, of Amazon images and product descriptions, we sometimes sample the data. Instead of working on the full data, what is sampling? Sampling basically means that we work on subset of data. Right, so the, we we only work on subset of data primarily so that everybody could successfully complete this workshop, even if they have a very small amount of memory or even if they have a little amount of time. Because if you work on full data, if you work on your full data, it might take longer, it might take significantly longer amount of time for the code to complete. It could take, I mean, we have seen cases where. Uh, to work on the full data, it could take you multiple hours of just computational time, right? To accommodate students of all uh, students who may not have like four or five hours to run their code and wait for the code to give outputs. Sometimes we, we operate on sample data. We'll explain wherever we operate on sample data, but any student who is interested to work on the full data should perfectly be able to do it, right? It's, it's, you can easily uh, extend the code that we explain you to, to the full data. 